Okay, cool. All right, so we're going to fix this problem. We've been seeing a lot where people try to send a print. Um, and let's just uh, try to print this page and we'll get an example of what that looks like. So I'm going to go to, let's see, let's just do um, ESPN, just a site, any site. All right, and then we'll go to this button on a Mac. <clears throat> oh, God, Mac is always making things more. Here we go. Print. Let me print. All right. So your Epson is the one. Uh, we're going to send a print one page, and we'll see what it says. So we'll resume the printer. We'll go to it, and what we'll see is this error. Encryption credentials have expired. Right. So what we're going to do to fix that, <clears throat> we're going to go to the gear, and we're going to show the printer web page. Um, there's other ways to do this. Um, if, if someone doesn't use a Mac, they basically they'll need the IP address for the printer and they can get that by running an IP scan. Uh, but the way we're gonna do it on the Mac is to show printer web page. <clears throat> That's gonna take us to this Epson web page for the printer. Um, we're gonna go first, uh, let's see. We're gonna go to the main page. We're gonna go up here and go to advanced settings. And then we're going to go to, I think it's uh, network and security, I think. I got a certificate, right? So this is basically because of a certificate that's built into the printer that I think by default lasts 10 years. And so when your printer gets that old or whenever the certificate expires, you start getting that error. So what we're going to do is we are going to create a, another self-signed certificate. I think that's all that's required. In the meantime, we will go clear out this print and we will close this for now. <clears throat> So last time I did this, it took a few minutes. So I'm gonna hit pause on this video. <clears throat> okay, so now we're gonna go back, I've refreshed the page, we're gonna go back to certificate and we're gonna go update. And we wanna do another 10 year validation. And we're gonna say next. And we're gonna say, okay. All right, again, we're gonna wait a few minutes again. Okay, so um, I went back to certificate, um, refreshed again, um, and then went to, um, let's see here, I'll do it one more time. We're going to go to confirm so we can see the certificate. And this is the cert. And if you scroll down, you can see now that it's it'll run all the way through 2023, or 2033, sorry, which is 10 years from today. So now that that's done, um, we should test the printout again and see what we get. We may need to re-add the printer, but sometimes you don't. So let's see what happens. One to one, it'll be black and white. And the print. Resume. So see, now we don't see the error anymore. Um, your printer should be engaging. Do you hear it? Yeah. Okay, cool. So that's how you accomplish fixing this Epson certificate issue. Um, so I hope it helps. It's awesome.